Hi, my name is Marcia. And I'm Monica. And I'm Rhea. And our project is about filtering carbon dioxide from car exhaust. And we wanted to use low cost and easily attainable materials to do this. So in this experiment, we used Alka-Seltzer tablets as a source of CO2, and we kept checking the CO2 monitor frequently. First, we did this experiment with nothing in our middle pipe. This was our control. For the control, we got levels of around 45 millimeters mercury of carbon dioxide. Next, we tried the experiment using different filtering materials. First, we used activated carbon because it's known as a CO2 adsorber, and we found that the data was between 10 to 12 millimeters mercury. Later, we used cat litter and got readings between 10 to 15 millimeters mercury. We also used brown sugar to do the same procedure because it had the same consistency, and we wanted to make sure that the carbon dioxide was flowing through to the monitor. Here's an example of what we did during our experiment. First, we dropped two tablets of Alka-Seltzer into 300 milliliters of water. The carbon dioxide produced, between, produced by the chemical reaction between the Alka-Seltzer and the water would flow through this and get filtered by the filtering material we would put in the middle pipe. Currently, it's empty. Then, the filtered carbon dioxide would flow through these pipes and the monitor would read the amount of carbon dioxide. Um, our results showed that the activated carbon worked the best at absorbing carbon dioxide, and the cat litter came in a close second. The levels of carbon dioxide for our brown sugar and our control tests were much higher than the levels for the activated carbon in the cat litter, proving that this does work. We hope that these results could be used to stop carbon dioxide from polluting our environment and to help save the Earth. Thank you.